the mechanism here we apply is basically rely on the NPF uh, contribution records. And for those records provided by the applicant through the uh, trustees that uh, we will receive, we will be able to tell how many and how exactly each one of the employees on the list are receiving from the employers. And in this particular scheme, in the 2022 ESS scheme, we actually require, if we have given each one a full-time staff $8,000 uh, wage subsidy, then as appear on the, those records, they will at least receive $8,000. Uh, and they will be nothing less than $8,000. So by checking the records, we can ensure that the employers are, are not pocketing the money on, on, on their own accounts, but to pay to the, each individual employees. The um, enterprise may employ new staff and staff may resign. So there can be natural turnover. So we will not be checking on individuals, on individual information per se, but then at least we know that they are paying the employees, each person, a given minimum amount.